All right, I guess I need to talk to her first. You flatter me with your attention, Outlander. Go ahead. Hello. Thank you, Karaoke, for rescuing me. Now I'll stay here at Hole of Mine with Master Borello and assist him in the monastery's library. He's the head of our secret order. We have adopted the name Dissident Priests. We are not ashamed of our disputes with the temple's hierarchy. We are fiercely loyal to the temple's ancient, ancient traditions, but we are troubled that the ultimate source of the tribunal's divinity might be the same as the source of Dagoth Ur's evil power. Dagoth Ur's power seems to wax as the tribunal's power wanes. Read the progress of truth and any other documents of the apographa in our library and you'll see why we are uneasy. Okay. Progress of Truth is a green book. Blasphemous Resonance. Hey, I want it though. <laughs> then Vivek left. It. This is like a really, really long book. It's like 36 parts. I must have that one already. Let's see, I'm looking for the progress of truth which I'm assuming will be on one of these shelves. And I think it's a green book. Okay, it should have been on one of these shelves. Maybe it's somewhere else. Speak, my Traveler. time is precious, so make it quick. Excuse me. Damn, what what do you want? What do you want? Looking for a certain book. I will listen, Outlander, but make it quick. Uh, you guys have some really nice lights. Don't on. stand about. What do you want? I'll have to ask them where I find it. Welcome, I friend. I've seen it before. Are you the one I've heard talk Speak, about? Speak, traveler. I'm gonna ask her about it. She doesn't say anything about it. I'm gonna talk to him about it. Um, dissident priest, tell me what you know. A significant part of the temple hierarchy might be more inclined to accept and tolerate differences of opinion and dogma, but other parts of the temple, in particular the ordinators under Beryl Sala, claim that the threat of the Red Mountain and Dagoth Ur can only be resisted with a unified, resolute faith. The people are afraid, so they support the hard line. But if we show ourselves able to confront Dagoth Ur more effectively than the ordinators, the temple and the people will support us. So what do you tell me about Dagoth Ur? So long as the Ordinators, Buoyant Armagers, and Tribunal could contain the Blight and Dagoth Ur's creatures within the Ghost Fence, faith in the Temple's protective power was strong, but now travelers and settlements suffer from Blight Storms and marauding monsters, and the people fear the Temple is losing its ages-old battle with the Devil, Dagoth Ur. Uh, I guess... I need to ask you about the Lost Prophecies. I have reviewed the Apographa and have found two passages of particular interest. We've made copies of these passages to give you. Many are familiar with the two Nerevarine prophecies current among the Ashlanders called The Stranger the S and The Seven Vision. 
We have two other prophecies, the Lost Prophecy and the Seven Curses, that may offer additional insights into the, riddle, into the riddles surrounding the coming of the Incarnate. Perhaps these are the Lost Prophecies that your friend Nabani Maisa told you about. What's the Apocrypha? Oh. Kagranak Tools. We have also prepared a document for you called Kagranax Tools. This document will explain to you and others the terrible secret that the temple conceals about the true history of the tribunal and the corrupt nature of their divine powers. It is to conceal this secret that the temple persecutes the reverend and the dissident priests. This persecution must stop. We must be united against the true enemy, Dagoth Ur. And if you are the Reverend, you must lead us against him. It's, uh, okay. Well, what will you tell me about these uh, seven curses and lost prophecies? And uh, I guess I'll have to read Kagranak's tools myself. Seven curses. Through the doors of the unmoored house, where scoffers scoff and schemers scheme from the halls of Oath... The oath-breaking house, seven ring, rings, seven curses of God's blasphemed. First curse, curse of fire, curse of ash, curse of flesh, curse of ghosts, curse of fire, curse of ash, curse of flesh, curse of ghosts, curse of seed, curse of despair, curse of dreams. Your copy of the Seven Curses bears our guesses at interpret interpreting the verses. In short form, Seven Curses come from House Dagoth, or House Dwimmer, or both. Fire and Ash come from Red Mountain. Flesh is corporous. Ghost, Seed, and Despair are unclear, but Curse of Dream seems to refer to recent cases of soul sickness and sleeper attacks in the towns. Lost Prophecies. We have given you the copies of Kagranek's Tools, Lost Prophecy, and Seven Curses. From what you tell me, you may now have the Lost Prophecies and the Wise Woman that the Wise Woman asked you to seek. Perhaps you should share your new knowledge with her. What do you tell me about Sixth House? This is a new threat, and not yet widely recognized as another face of the devil, Dagoth Ur. But it is clearly a sign of a coming crisis, and the temple may, longer, may no longer be able to protect Morrowind. In such troubled times, the Dunmer may turn to the ancient pillars of faith that ancestors and Adra, and especially to the prophetic visions granted by Lord Azura. Then they may look to the Reverend St. Nerebar Reborn to lead them against the grim armies of Dagoth Ur. Huh, so I guess I have to go back. I think that's all I'm going to find here. I need the progress of truth, but I'm going to have to find that somewhere else. Yeah, I'm going to go back. Shit. 21, finally. I should try to make some things. Oh my god. Floating stuff. Looks terrible. I don't see progress of truth in there. Um, let's see, where do I need to go? I'm gonna go to Vivek. Vivek. Damn, look at all the stuff floating. Three forty one is not bad. Oh, lights. 
I will place these lights eventually. That's very not set in stone when, but look at this nice lantern I found. Here's a great one too. It's got bluish light. Another bug lamp. Alright, I'm leaving. We've got all these pieces of paper now. Oh, trap. I can put that down somewhere. And Halgard's tail. That's a big book. bottom part of the stack makes it look impossible. All right. Why walk when you can ride? Take me to Vivek, sir. I'm gonna use a flight. We make a special trip just for you. Same low price. So it's a long walk. But I'm not swimming around the coast. I'm just going to fly over those mountains from cool or cold or whatever you call it. Do I have anything to make me run faster? Fuck it, I'll take it. This should at least get me there. I wish I could go around buying everyone's... all their stuff. So they wouldn't have any inventory. Then when you need to trade with them, that kind of sucks. Like, buy all the cheap stuff and trade them expensive shit. I'm getting somewhere, though. I can go back to this camp. And I think then I'm going to have to make friends with the other three camps. Or wait, maybe... Maybe this wise woman sends me to Kokoroon. Finally, I know I have to go there sometime. <laughs> 